Hey guys, uh, Eddie and Liam, and we're going to be showing you a little bit of Dungeon Defenders, a game I have played quite a bit of, and Eddie has played none of. Yes. So I'm going to be doing the playing. Okay. Uh, we want to play local. His robe and Ooh. Out. The apprentice is no. Uh, we'll go. Ooh. Oh yeah, they don't have any of this stuff in the console version. I've only played console, but the only difference is this one's got a lot more content, no difference in gameplay. Uh, yeah. Squire, this guy, he's basically... Yellow, yellow please. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, prim... <laughs> full, full red, full green, and full blue, I think. Oh no, it's full red and... Full red and green. Is it? No? Yes. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Accessory colour, we will make it white. Pink. Pink? Or purple? Pink. Pink. There yeah, you go. Yeah, look at him, he rocks. Okay. Next. Change outfit. Ooh, this is something I don't. Oh, I haven't. haven't okay. Got yet. Oh. No, he's changed back. No, he's not yellow anymore. Mitt Bunny. Wait, we had Bunny. Oh, wait, we what? Had bunny. Can... Go back to Bunny. I can't go back. Yeah, you can. Use the arrows. That's, that's color schemes, not. Oh, no. I want to find the Bunny again. You will be a bunny. Yes! I'm sure we got the. Collect go. 24 eggs in your item. Be the bunny! Change out. Oh, whoops. Oh. <sighs> okay. Okay. Now. What was it? Bright yellow bunny. Full red and full green. <laughs> yellow bunny and. Oh, what colour uh, do we want the belly? Um, we'll have ooh. it. Red. Red. Oh, and the out. accessory orange. Has. What is the accessory? I can't really see it. It's that bit in there. The Ooh, wow, that chest. looks beautiful. Let's do it. <laughs> Go. Huh? No. I. What? Can we not be the? I don't uh. think we can be the bunny. <sighs> Hello. Silly game. Why would you do that to us? Ah, oh, that'll do. Yes. Let's yeah. just go for it. Athena. No. What? Oh, no. Bruno. That's better. Bruno. Uh, that's fine. Ooh, you I don't can think... change the color of your crystal. <laughs> wow. I don't think we've got any more crystals. Nah, seemingly not. You have oh, to do lots and lots of noises. <laughs> you have to do lots of challenges to get crystals. Let's stick with the okay. basic one. Okay, so Bruno, oh, level, level zero. zero. So, that's Looking? good. Yep. We'll Select. All done. Go. Start. Mm. Shush. Level up is now available. You don't want to do that. We want to level up, and I'm not sure how you do that. Uh, controls. Ooh. Click on the little thingy down. Can't. It's locked in the middle, is it? Um... Okay, let's get a feel for the controls. See? Okay, so all the stuff is bounded. Now that's cool. Uh, e, Q, Q is behind. Tab is sometimes like inventory. That's not tab, that's tab. What was that? What did it bring up? That brought up um, chat. chat and I guess also um, console maybe. I don't mm, know. Might be. Shift, tab, T? control. L for level up. You know what? Let's just look at the controls. <laughs> um, I is inventory. That, that makes perfect sense. Ah, uh, yeah. And it, we can probably get to it from that, can't we? Possibly. I don't know. Let us see. No, 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 no. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not I, looking. I, yes. Ah, here we go. Okay, what can we do? We can level up health, damage... Uh, points to spend. Well, Okay. Uh, we'll want to start with a tower-based uh, squire. So, basically, okay. you want to put all of your points into either your hero or your defences. Why? Because you don't have enough points to basically be both. Which reasonably. One, which one so, would you say is better? Starting out defenses and go with okay. the squire because the squire's defenses are just unequivocally the best for okay. starting out. Uh, base damage. We'll go with that for now. Woohoo! Okay. No, no inventory. So. 
Uh, e mission setup. Start level campaign yeah. on medium. Yeah, medium. Yeah, that's good. Hardcore mood. You got a sneeze. There we go. That's the skip. Keep the cutscenes. Don't want to spoil the story for you guys. Yep. Mm. <laughs> the wonderful, wonderful story that is told in like three paragraphs. <laughs> Um, okay, so, begin with, there's these chests everywhere, and they have mana in, and mana is used for both abilities, which you can see some on the bottom there, yeah. and the towers themselves. Okay, so what, you have to buy the towers with? With the mana, and enemies drop mana, you have, okay, I can only carry 40 at the moment. Uh, so, what does that mean? You can that means that. I can build... Some are, oh, I'm not high enough level yet. So all I can build so far is this, which is literally just spikes. Just spikes. The enemy walks up to it, they try and beat it down, and they take damage. Okay. There's much better ones later on. We've yeah. got the spikes, the bumper blockade, which is that one next to it. Number seven. Number seven. Okay. Uh, that one is kind of like this one, only it does more damage and launches them when they try and attack it. Okay. Uh, you got the harpoon, which is number eight. Yeah. Which is a harpoon. Okay, <laughs> right. <laughs> so. Um, that's all there really is to that one. And you've got the bowling ball turret, which is okay. But it's kind of situational. It fires in one direction. Um, does a lot of damage. The projectiles bounce around. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's it because okay. it's it doesn't aim. It just sort of fires in one direction when there's an enemy in that direction. Right. So, so it's kind of situational. So you've got skills on number six, seven, eight, nine, zero are your towers, and then. One, two, three, four, five seem to be character abilities. The final tower is okay. It's um, it's called the oh god, I can't remember the name of it. One second. Ultimate awesome. Uh, slice and dice. That's it. Uh, it's basically, uh, it's a big sort of tower thing. And right, that's that. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean it's literally <laughs> like a tower, like a right, yeah. yeah. And uh, when enemies get near it it starts spinning and these blades sort of spin up to a high speed and sort of nice. then they're vertical and they chop them up and it's uh it's expensive does loads of damage and if you've upgraded it enough you know if you've upgraded your towers yeah. it's also really really uh really really resistant and damaging what so you set up sort of two on each side i guess yeah. So what are you going to do with that money you just got then? Uh, 40. There's nothing I really can do. Uh, there's I'm healing that. that all of the classes have. Uh, then the squire's got that what spinning that? attack, which is on number 2. Number 1 hero. Oh, he's the one who's done best on this level ever. Level 83, score 1 billion. What? Yeah. Okay, you, I'm guessing you get lots and lots of points. So you go to the crystal, you okay. activate it, and bam. And now, Enemy you just wait for the enemies to come out. I see them. And I could wait for them to go up to the tower, but... Could take a while. Yeah. So you can attack, like that. Oh, okay. And then there's, and there's archers. Archers are horrible. They will occasionally... Get, they they will occasionally stand somewhere where your towers can't do anything to them, and they can just take pot shots at all your stuff, and it's annoying as hell. Yeah, see there, this one has fire resistance. You see that sort okay, of. Okay, yeah, the. Glow. And that basically means some some weapons that you pick up have elemental damage on them. Yeah. Some towers, specifically like the. Um, the Huntress, which lays down these like activated traps, and the uh, Apprentice, which has like magic-based towers, they do specific like type damages, and some creatures are immune to that. 
I like, so, I like how he's not wearing any trousers. Yeah, this, this game's Casually. got a. This, this game's a bit silly. Uh, Ooh, what's that? Oh, God, where's the button to wear? Oh, requires hero level 3, never mind. Uh, yeah, you pick up equipment, and the equipment is randomly generated. It can be either Sword. absolutely amazing or the worst piece of terrible thing ever. So as I just got, equip that sword. As we've got all the mana hanging around, you may as well... Oh, when you start the level, any mana hanging around gets instantly sent to your bank, which you can't use during the level, but... You get but it for next. But it means you can go buy better equipment in the tavern. Okay. Which is very, very useful. And if you, well, we got a bit of spare. So is it not worth putting maybe a couple of other blockades, like? Yeah, yeah. Um, or fair enough. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, so six. Uh, really, I these you won't really use them once you've unlocked yeah. the um the next one along the next one along because it's basically an upgraded version it's got knockback to it okay. and so on all right um let's stick no, they won't be coming from there, will they? there's another door up there which okay they might actually do. i don't know they might come from ah, that one leave it ah oh, god that's not what i want where's the uh e q Ah, oh, there we go. You can sell defenses, you can repair them if okay. they take damage from the enemies, and so on and so forth. So, yeah. And the game can get the game can get really good if you got more than a few people playing. What? There's 19 enemies this time. There was only six last time. Yeah, the waves so. get you know harder as you go along, yeah. which makes sense. Uh, so it doesn't matter. Enemies. The give you sort of experience based purely on what what difficulty you're playing on yeah and whether you yourself kill them or your towers kill them right but if you're specking into the defense stuff then you'll get less xp surely nope nope you always oh, you get, you the get the same xp for anything dying basically oh, okay. Okay. these the moment these things die they'll give me like what one experience yeah yeah and uh, I have to go deal with those archers, I haven't got any ranged towers up. And they're not stupid enough to go walking into them. He says. I, he says, yep, see? They're just going to stand right next to them. They're still getting hit, aren't they? So, yep. Um, nice. One it's there. a good game if you've got a lot of people playing it together, but the yeah. thing is, uh, good die. Um, it can get really difficult. Really what? difficult. There are different challenges. The higher difficulties are really difficult. Hmm. Oh, uh, I've leveled up. So, we will put something into defense health. Right, yeah. That uh, isn't actually good. Oh, I've got two points to spend. Yeah, so, um, uh, let's go... Uh, did it actually go in? Two damage. There we go. So close that. And four. Repair. Let's see if we get any nice tasty loot. Loot comes off of enemies Oops. as well. But it is oh that's better. Yeah. Um a little bit better. And we will. Not I can't. Free. I can't have that just yet. Um, you get loot off enemies, but that's mainly later on. Uh, bosses always drop unique things, but they um. Some sometimes they're just not as good. That's worse. Yeah. That's better. No, was it? No, it was worse. The thumbs up gives the thumbs up or thumbs down gives you a general idea if something's better or worse, but. Later on, things got so many stat boosts and stuff yeah. that you, you got you got to make that call for yourself, really. They're the same. <laughs> oh, if they're the same, they'll have a um, sort of sideways thumb mm. as well. Thumbs. So. It's on fire. So one sec. Sorted. Uh nope. See, it shows you where the enemies are coming yeah. from, how many, and what types. 
So sometimes they know, will come from over there. Okay. They'll come from over there, and uh, it will show you what exactly they are. And yeah. how did these take? Oh wait, it's because I upgraded the health, didn't I? They haven't actually taken damage. They can just have more health. So that's that. If you're ever wondering why something may have taken damage when it shouldn't have, it's probably because you upgraded. I forgot about that. Alright, okay. It doesn't, like, instantly give yeah. it more health. You have to go spend to give it more health if you upgrade mid-level. Right, in Pokemon, I'm trying to remember, when you leveled up, it fully healed your Pokemon, didn't it? No. It know. gave them some back, I believe. Not? It gave them some health back, but I don't think it fully healed them. Some RPGs give you like yeah. a full heal, but in Pokemon I, I don't give yeah, it. It gave it a health boost, but no. See, there's a lot more coming there. Yeah, so yeah, 26 in total. <laughs> this auto lock on camera can be a little annoying. Yeah. Mm. But yeah. Jumping around all over the place. No, don't jump up there. They're not doing that much damage. Yeah, at the start, if you're going for a tower thing, you're one of just going to attack them. Because your towers aren't that good and you don't have that many towers. Um, let's give them an area of effect and a uh, attack rate. So now we've got the next one along, but we don't have more mana. Well, um, oh, no, we do. We have eighty. Yeah, when you level up, you okay. get a higher, a higher mana. So if we sell that one, maybe, and try out the yeah, yeah, or something. Yeah. So uh, one sec. It? What was it again? It was the middle button. Uh, sell defense. They lose value if you've had them for if you know you got them a different round from when you sell them. Yeah. But if you sell them when you first give, when get you first them. get them, then ooh, that's uh, like. that's better. Electricity or something. Yep, and um, if you get them, you know, what's this like? Um, uh, you haven't got any, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's it's better. Um, yeah, if you've, uh, what was I saying? Something about selling and over rounds, they lose. Oh, yeah, value. they lose value, but if you sell them the same round as when you bought them, they have the exact same value. So, um, these things will send them flying back. They're much bigger, they do more yeah. damage. They're just generally an upgrade in every way. So, so what's the um, most amount of people you can have on a multiplayer? Um, four, I believe. Okay, that's cool. It was four on the consoles, I know, yeah. at least. Um, You're going to sell that one as well? Yeah. However, we're going to have to keep an eye out because I'll show you in a second. So this one coming up from the top yeah, there, yeah, but that's like, I think, they, I think they're called ogres? No, no, the ogres are the really big ones. It's like a troll or something. Okay. And they're quite big. At lower levels, they can really mess your stuff up. Yeah. It's alright though, because hopefully the rest of them won't get past sort of those two bouncers. No, that, that should be good. So we can just focus on the yep, there, troll. Yep, there is one. The ogres later on, they are really big. They they are quite dangerous. See, the annoying thing is about elemental um, effects on weapons is everything resists. Like literally, the moment you get anything that can with, do any sort of elemental damage, you'll have <laughs> crowd surfing. Yeah, they they will. It will seem like everything resists it. But, yeah, see, there's a big one up. There's Where another um, big one up there. Oh, see it. He's wandered down here, and he got he killed. All oh, right, wow. Good, good job, him. So, um, yeah. Complete. Final wave! <laughs> Level up to four. Um, let's damage, stick, max the damage. Stick another health, yeah. and another damage. Health and damage are your main ones, really. Yeah. Area of effect and that are nice, but... Uh, skills go up to... I forget how high it is on PC. Uh, it, the level cap and the thing got... And the... Um, how high the damage can... The, like, points can go into a skill. Yeah. Got, like, b um, raised on the PC version, but I don't know how high. Was there no update for the consoles, then, that were just... Um, I think... 
they, I think they might be doing it for the consoles, but Not it's yet. delayed. Because yeah. you know. of all the stuff they have to go for the consoles. Yeah, it's Boy. stupid. But uh, that's, nah, that's rubbish. Yeah, but if you store it in your item box, you can just go back, you can go through it all, you can lock stuff, which means it won't be sold, and then there's like... It's going green. Uh... Hmm. No. See, there's... You can, um... That's another thing. You can upgrade equipment by pouring mana into it from your bank, but, uh... There's a slight issue with doing that, in that, you know, it's got a max level cap on them. How many times you can level it up, and then you yeah. can upgrade the stats on the weapon itself. So you don't really want to do that till you've got one like uber weapon. So yeah, it can be. It can cost a lot and not give you much. Yeah. Um, but that. Oh yeah, that's another thing. A uh, small tip. Um, upgrade elemental damage. It. The upgrades on elemental damage are sort of like. Um, they sort of. I don't know. What's they're not scaled right, or they're they they sort of scale, yeah. Really so quite well. yeah, they scale. Whereas the da the upgrades to damage itself are incremental, so they always yeah. go up the same amount. Um, so if you upgrade um, elemental damage in the long run, you will have a lot more damage. But the downside is uh, there's like five elements, I think, four or five. Yeah, so like a quarter or a fifth of the enemies will resist, and they, yeah. you'll, you'll just do nothing to them, which is where team play comes into work. Yeah, um, so you've all got like different element swords and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's cool. Ah, get him! I'll deal with the big guys up top first. They're both coming at once. Oh no, they're turning around. Uh, they've decided to go and have a pop at the um, bouncer. Really oh, okay. see? There, an enemy dropped some uh, stuff. It's not very good. I'll yeah. store it for now. Um, Ooh. Wee, they do go flying. <laughs> Yeah, see, this guy resists electricity, so I'm doing like no damage. So we're just gonna let the bouncer do all him. Run away. On half health. Yep, well. So the one lets you heal yourself. You're kind of vulnerable though, but it costs mana. Yeah. Every like class has that ability. Ah, here we go. Success is about to. He's just got to. He just got shoved off, and he's gonna. Yep, Yay. see? And then the level is complete. This is just the first level, it's very basic. Some of the later ones have got all these roots and stuff. Yeah. They're like Orcs Must Die, because I mean, these, both of those games came out last year and they've got their traps and stuff. But. Um, ooh, I, I leveled up twice. Yeah, that's something. If you do really well, like, in a tight... Five yeah. points. If you're, fa if you're playing on your s by yourself, you will level up very fast. Yeah. So, but so if you want to catch up, it's quite easy to sort of... Yeah, it's quite do. easy to pop into yeah. a single player and do it. Um, but... Yeah, we'll just... And then one more damage. Ah, oh, that's not damage. And, um... Circular Slice ability is now available. Uh... Let's show that. Oh, I can't. Um... Because no, it's not the combat phase, I guess. Yeah, um... So I'll show you a bit of the tavern, and then we'll sort of end it off here. And I guess I might. We, do I some might, more. I might do some more. Yeah. Let's see. I'll, I'll play. I'll play it before you next come around, and then you can sort of give advice, or maybe maybe I'll play, and you should tell me what I'm not doing. Why am right I collecting this? That's another thing. When you end the level again, all mana gets like sent to your bank when you end the level. Yeah. Man. Also, um, equipment. Gets turned in, gets like converted to mana if it's not been picked up. Okay. So that's, cool. that's useful. So we got 6,000 points and that dude got, what was it, over a billion points? Yeah. Um. Dope. Next we level. Don't want to go to next level. We want, to want to return to the, um, return to tavern. Yeah. Let's just go to the next level and. Then go from there. Go from there to the tavern. Okay. That way you're so certain. That way you're certain that you've gotten yeah. you know, all yeah. the mana done and everything. 
Um, yeah, this one's again a basic one. Where's the map? It's shift, I believe. Yeah, okay, they, so they come, from they come out of those sides. red zones and then they go up the stairs. And, yeah, you know, okay. So and got sort of the bet you, you can, you know, block it up here and only have to have yeah. three defenses, but pour all your mana into those. That's kind of a risky move. You can put them at the doors themselves. That's again yeah. only three you need to cover, but yeah, okay. there's a few ways you can do this level. Alright, so back to the tavern. Yeah. So and then you can chase a few bits in there and then whoosh. And then dinner I think. Yeah. Mm. Nom, nom, nom. Uh clothes. So you've got this dude, the tavern keeper, he can oh, sell you pets area. which they Help fly you. around, they will get you know, they'll they each one's got a few different abilities, like some yeah. attack, some will buff any tra any like sort of towers okay, that yeah. are near you can buy some good weapons they're based on your level so, you know. so no, no great ones at the moment no no and then you know armor okay and you can also xp bonus you put in so much mana <laughs> and you get you know an xp bonus for however right. long i've never really yeah. used that because uh yeah just uh, you can have all of your points taken out so that you can put them back in whenever okay, you want. so if you just want to redo... And, and something really stupid, you can rename, rename your hero wow. as well. If you really yeah. feel... You know. If you feel inclined to it. Oh look, uh, dragon parrots. Yep, yeah, there's tavern, some... I Oh, this is from the DLC where there's like, you got to collect some shards. I guess those go up there when you've collected okay. them. Um, uh, this is your forge, uh, you can go in here, you can check out your hero, you can look at the equipment you've got on, you can upgrade okay. it from here, you can look at your stats and things, yeah. your item box, all the stuff you picked up, all the stuff rubbish. I picked up, this is, oh this is useful, I've not seen this, Make a folder. Ooh, folder, so you can store stuff, okay, New folder. What so you can mean? make folders and things, that's a new okay. one on me, but that's cool. Um, you can sort of lock stuff so that it won't get sold if it's like too high level but you want to hang on to it. Or and if then, you want to just sell everything apart from the lock. And then you can sell everything, there's a button that's literally just sell everything, that yeah. um, sell all, that just sells everything that's not locked. Okay. And um... um yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff. Uh, there's these let you see your damage and DPS. Uh, trophies will appear around the room if you do uh, challenges, if you complete in-game challenges. Little secret, once you complete the main story, or do you have to do the bonus level that comes after the story? I don't remember, but either one, this door becomes non-solid. You can walk through it. <laughs> and uh, there's a secret room in there. I'll save what's in there. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's about it for the tavern. Um, right. It's good. You can sort of check you out. You can also set up your towers yeah. near these things to see what they do. What damage they do as well. Oh, and uh, you know, you can. It's all free. Doesn't cost any mana oh, in the tavern. Cool. That's the spinny attack. There's also Blood Rage, which basically damage and how much damage you output, how much damage you take, it's all you know, improved, but it costs okay. mana constantly. Right, yeah. Okay, I get it. Select defense to upgrade. Oh yeah, that's something. You can also upgrade yeah. defenses. I never mentioned that. Because didn't, oh, really, oh, right. I see. didn't so really need to. You can put mana into yeah. it to upgrade it. It's a quick boost to it. It's so like like your standard tower defense, you yeah. level up a couple of main towers and then you're all they, good. They always start out at the lowest level, you have yeah. to put mana in every time you start a game. Yeah. That's basically the yeah. gist of it all. Okay, that's cool. I'll give it a go before next week, and then next week we'll give it another go and try one of the slightly tougher levels, I think, because that was pretty much a walkover. Yeah, that was. <laughs> um, yeah, if you get a bit further in, we'll have a look at it. Be great if we could split screen. We might have to look into that. Have to grab a controller from somewhere. Yeah. All right. Let's just stand on top of the crystal. That's that's cool. Yeah. So yeah. And that's Bye. it. Bye.